Hi, my name's Tom. I'm the inventor of Tie Pro Tying Tools. These tools make tying knots and threading small eyelets easier and faster for you. Don't hesitate to use it in low light situations like morning fishing or evening, or if you have cold hands because you're ice fishing or on a rocking boat. To tie an improved clinch knot using the fly and ice tool, I've selected a number 14 elk hair caddis. First thing you have to do is make a clean clip on the end of your line. Make sure it's flat. Next, open the tool slightly so you can push the hair back a little bit on the, from around the eyelet. Press the fly in a little bit firmly so it's set, seated well. Then take your line and feed it through the funnel. You may need to create some twisting motion here as you do this to help feed the line through the funnel. Pull your line through and start to create your twists. Again, create usually six or seven twists for a light line. Feed it back through the wide area held open by the tool and then send it back through the loop you just created to make the improved portion of the clinch knot. Pull your line partially tight for the knot, then wet your line and pull it up tight to the fly. Next, carefully go in and clip your line off with the blade and anvil clipper as close as you'd like and you're good to fish. Your Tie Pro tools come with a lanyard and a lockdown bead. Simply lock the tool on the lanyard and slide the bead down against the tool so that you won't knock it off while you're fishing. You need access to the tool, loosen the bead, pull it off and use it. It's free for tying, the lanyard won't get in the way for you. The Tie Pro Fly and Ice tool is good for most flies from size 2 down to number 16. Anything smaller than that you're going to struggle with. It's also good for jigs from 1 64th ounce up to 1 8th ounce. Tippets down to 8x are fine for use and up to about 20 thousandths inch diameter. If you have any more questions, go to our website and click on the FAQs tab. Get yours at typro.com.